Welcome to the Rapid Fire with the Alberni Valley Bulldogs. You know the rules. You have 60 seconds to answer as many questions as you can. Are you ready, Adam? I'm ready, Jose. Uh, all right. Surfing or skydiving? Skydiving. What's your favorite original six NHL team? Uh, Montreal Canadiens. What's your favorite all-time Vancouver Canuck? Stan Smeal. Uh, who's tougher, Arnold Schwarzenegger, Sylvester Stallone, or Bruce Willis? Bruce Willis. What's your favorite city? Chicago. What's your favorite book? Uh, tipping Point, How Little Things Make a Big Difference. Very nice. I read that book, too. Very good book. Uh, how do you like your eggs? It's, uh, poach soft. Who will win the Stanley Cup this season? No one. Ooh, interesting. Oh. <laughs> well, who's your favorite all-time NHL coach? Uh, Mike Babcock. <laughs> Very good. Uh, what's the last great movie you saw? Uh, Moneyball. Moneyball. Uh, who's faster, Superman or The Flash? Superman. Who's smarter, Batman or The Joker? Joker. Very good. Cool. Right. <laughs> uh, what's better, oatmeal or cereal? Oatmeal. Uh, what's your favorite movie? Uh, usual Suspects. Very nice. Okay. Rock, paper, scissors. Are you ready, Adam? Ready. Let's do this. One, two, three. Dynamite always wins. Ah, uh, ah, uh, yes, I win. <laughs> I win. Thanks for joining us. We for so did not win that. The game's called Rock, Paper, Scissors, Jenny. Dynamite does not count. Dynamite beats everything. No. No. Okay, okay. Let's go talk to an expert, and we'll see what they say. Fine. I'll get the camera. Hi, Ron. How you doing? Good. How about yourself? Not too bad, thanks. Yeah, um, well, uh, I need an expert's opinion on this. Does dynamite beat rock, paper, scissors? Dynamite, rock, paper, scissors. I know a bit about hockey, but I don't know a lot about rock, paper, scissors. Like, I, I think you're going to have to go to a higher authority, like maybe the mayor or somebody? The mayor? I'm sure he makes decisions like that all the time. Okay. All right. Well, thanks for your help. Go for it. Mr. Mayor, well, I need an expert opinion on this. Does dynamite beat rock, paper, scissors? Well, first of all, Jose, just call me John. Okay, John. Okay. Now, um, I've had uh, the opportunity to, to hear a bit about this controversy and had some input from uh, some of our concerned citizens. And it's been suggested to me, and it seems pretty viable, actually, that scissors can cut the fuse off the dynamite. However, you know, even though I am the mayor, um, I think a legal opinion might be, uh, you know, a good step to take. And, uh, you know, maybe, in fact, you probably should consult a lawyer, you know, to, to get a legal opinion on this. Oh, really? Really, I think so. I think that's the way you got to go. Okay. All right. Well, thanks for your help, Mr. Mayor. Okay. You're John. welcome. I hope I was a help. Yeah, <laughs> I think so. Thank you. Oh, hey Charles, how you doing? Hey, yeah. Thanks for seeing me. Good morning. So Charles, I, I don't understand this whole fiasco with rock, paper, scissors. Does dynamite even count? Well, it's not my uh, preferred area of practice. Um, and uh, I would uh, first of all ask to see if the person uh, you're dealing with has a permit. And if not, uh, I, would, um, I would definitely refer to an expert on the issue. So I gotta see someone else now. Yeah. Look, Jen. Experts. Hey guys. So, does dynamite beat rock, paper, scissors? Dynamite beats everything. Dynamite beats everything? Yeah! What? Okay, you win. Are you happy? <laughs>